Hey YouTube! Back for another Japanese lesson again, and uh, I don't know if you can see from there, but if you're wondering why my eyes are red and why I'm sniffling and stuff, it's because I ate some raw garlic. And I know, you're like, YouTuber, why the crap are you eating some raw garlic? Well, I'm glad you asked. The reason why is because eating raw garlic helps kill off a lot of these viruses that, are, that give you the flu and give you the cold and it works really well. I'm actually pretty much over it now, but I'm having one more piece tonight just in case. Other natural things that help get you over the flu are uh, elderberry syrup or elderberry juice and also organ oil. Organ oil has a lot of healing qualities. I'm, I was pretty surprised about it. Anyways, a lot of people are still getting sick so I just wanted to let you guys know this so keep healthy and get enough sleep too. Alright, on to our lesson. The lesson for today, I'm going to teach you guys the different ways of saying excuse me and sorry in Japanese. Now, in America at least, those are the two main ones that we use. Is excuse me, when you say excuse me is when, you, when you're trying to interrupt someone uh, politely, or if you're trying to cut through. Uh, sorry is used mainly to ask for forgiveness or if you did something wrong. In Japanese, it's pretty similar but there are certain words that are versatile to use not only in the sorry situation but also in this excuse me situation. Now let me teach you how to say sorry. Sorry in Japanese is gomen nasai. Let me say that slower. Gomen nasai. You gotta connect those two ends as you see me printed right there. Uh, so it's gomen nasai. Sometimes people say gomen. That's just saying I'm sorry same translation, but when you say gomen, that probably should be only between your friends. Like, like in the other words that I've been teaching you, like arigato gozaimasu and all that, that there are certain ways that you could say to your friends, but rest of the time it should be towards your elder, your superior, um, teachers, people that you don't know. So you have gomen nasai, which is the standard way of saying sorry, and then there's gomen when you say sorry to a friend just for a minor thing. If you ever watch some old samurai anime and you see the samurai character walk into a room and they say gomen. Gomen was used that way but not anymore. Gomen back then was used like excuse me I'm entering the house. I think that's what it was anyways. There's also another way to say sorry which is sumimasen. Let me say that slower now, okay? Sumimasen. So together it's sumimasen. Now there's also a variation to use that which is suimasen. So instead of sumi, they say suimasen. The word sumimasen and suimasen are both used for saying sorry as well as excuse me. So if you're trying to cut through, mostly you'll hear people say, ah, sumimasen. Or they'll be like, excuse me, they'll say, ah, sumimasen. And then they'll go on to tell you what they wanted to tell you. But like I said, generally, sumimasen is used for when you're trying to cut through people. Now there's one more word that is related to this subject, and that's the word, shitsure shimasu. shimasu is mainly used to say, excuse me. Once in a while it's used if a person's entering into a room, uh, I would say mainly uh, entering into a person's home. They'll say, ah, shitsure shimasu. shimasu is also used uh, for excuse me. So the word sumimasen and shitsure shimasu are somewhat similar and it depends on how you want to use it. But they both generally mean excuse me. While sumimasen is the versatile word that could also be used for saying sorry. The term shitsure shimasu is made up of the word shitsure. The word shitsure in itself means rude. So if you were to translate the term shitsure shimasu literally, then it will literally translate to I'm being rude or I'm going to be rude. And this is the whole part of the Japanese culture where everything is, you have, you have to be really careful, being humble, and be like, excuse me for being rude. And that is, is the whole formality of it. But now it's a standard term that people use all the time. Now let's review over the words. First we have gomen nasai, which means I'm sorry. Gomen can be used but only between your close friends. Next we have sumimasen. Sumimasen is the versatile word which can mean both sorry and excuse me. 
Then we have shitsure shimasu, which means excuse me. Sometimes used when you enter into someone's home or if you're trying to cut through people. So, for example, Hi. あ、どうぞ分かってください。失礼します。え、少しお話ししたいことがあるんですけど、え、あの、ちょっと臭いですね。え、それ私ですけど、ニンニクを食べたので。あ、ごめんなさい。Okay, I hope all that was helpful, and I'll see you next in the next Japanese lesson. Ciao,